Hello students, this is module 3, Optimal Operation of the Generators on Bus Bar and Optimal Scheduling. In that first topic is Generator Operating Cost and Performance Curve. Okay, the generator operating cost not only includes fuel cost, it also includes labor as well as maintenance cost. But fuel cost is uh, the only cost considered to be variable. Okay, the fuel cost is considered in case of a thermal power plant, nuclear power plant, Okay, as well as a hydel power plant. Okay, first uh, curve is input output curve. This is the fundamental curve for the thermal power plant and it is the plot of input in a British thermal unit per hour or m kilo calorie per hour versus output of the plant. Okay, as shown in this figure. Okay, input output curve of generating unit specifies the input energy rate. Okay. Uh, input energy rate that is represented by Fi PGI. The unit is m kilo calorie per hour. Okay, or cost of the fuel or operating cost um, that is Ci PGI in rupees per hour. Okay, rupees per hour as a function of generator power um, power output uh, PGI megawatt. Okay, this is in megawatt. Next, we consider heat rate curve uh, that is called uh, that is indicated by HI PGI, which, uh, which is the heat energy in m kilo calorie needed to generate one unit of electrical energy that is in uh, megawatt hour. Heat rate is the ratio of fuel input in a British thermal unit to the energy output in kilowatt hour okay energy in output in kilowatt hour it is the slope of input versus output curve at any point the reciprocal of heat rate is called fuel efficiency okay. heat rate curve is a plot of heat rate versus output in uh, megawatt okay the heat rate unit is m kilo calorie per megawatt hour the output power unit is uh, m megawatt. The plot of heat rate curve is like this. The next topic is incremental fuel rate. The incremental fuel rate is equal to small change in input uh, divided by corresponding change in output. Okay, small change in input to the small change in output. The unit is rupees per hour. The uh, plot of incremental rate versus output is shown in figure. Okay, it is incremental fuel rate uh, in m kilo calorie per megawatt hour versus output power PGI in megawatt. Incremental cost curve. The incremental cost curve is a product of a fuel rate and fuel cost. Okay, so the plot is shown in figure. It is incremental fuel cost in rupees per megawatt hour versus output in megawatt. Okay, output PGI in megawatt. The curve is like this. Okay, here it is megawatt minimum power uh, output power minimum output power. This is megawatt maximum. And input energy rate, okay, which is given by input output curve. Okay, input output curve. Okay, so input energy rate is represented by Fi PGI, okay, which is given by formula Pi into Hi. Okay, Hi is obtained by the heat rate curve, right? Heat rate curve. Okay, so Fi PGI is equal to PGI into Hi PGI. The unit is m kilo calorie per hour. 
but input fuel cost which is given by formula k into FIPGI where k is a constant. Okay. And this heat rate curve is approximated as uh, HI PGI is equal to AI dash divided by PGI plus BI dash plus CI dash into PGI. The unit is M kilo calorie per megawatt hour. So, take this equation as equation 1 and this equation if you will input cost as equation 2 and heat rate curve equation as equation 3. And we know that FI PGI, FI PGI is what? PGI into HI PGI, okay. HI PGI uh, we, we got from heat rate curve which is, which is AI dash divided by PGI plus BI dash plus CI dash PGI, okay. So, FI uh, PGI where PGI is multiplied with the HI PGI. So, everywhere we have to multiply it, it by PGI. When we multiply it becomes AI dash plus BI dash PGI plus CI dash PGI square. Okay. So, the unit is M kilo calorie per R. Okay. M kilo calorie per R. Next, CI PGI k into fi pgi right so fi pgi is what ai dash b plus bi dash pgi plus ci dash pgi square so k into ai dash plus bi dash pgi plus ci dash small ci dash pgi square okay so k into ai dash which is uh, represented by ai K into BI dash, okay, we can call it as BI, okay, PGI you write as it is, K into CI dash, okay, take it as CI PGI square, the unit is rupees per hour, okay, the unit is rupees per hour. So, next incremental cost, incremental cost, it is a uh, differentiation of CI with respect to PGI. When we differentiate this, we get differentiation of AI, it is constant, no? So, it is 0. So, differentiation of BI PGI, okay? So, it is BI plus differentiation of CI PGI square, it is 2 PGI CI, the unit is rupees per megawatt hour. 